What's going on superstars? It's Sam Keys here again. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I want to show you how I customize my trading view chart for my analysis and make it look like the MetaTrader 5 chart. I'm going to be making use of the trading view implementation for Dayriv. So you want to visit the website tradingview.dayriv.com. Now, this is the default settings for the trading view for Dayriv. And you can see I have added my MACD indicator, but you can see that the MACD doesn't look like the MACD indicator for the MT5. This is my MT5 platform and you can see how the MACD actually appears. In this video, I'm going to show you how I customize this trading view platform to look exactly like the MetaTrader 5 platform. Now let's go over to the trading view platform, which is the trading view implementation for Dairy and I'm going to show you how to go about it. Because of the color scheme of TradingView, I want to use a blue candlestick for the bulls and a black candlestick for the bears. And I'm going to take off the grid on the background. So we'll just dive into settings and I'm going to go to appearance and I'm going to check this part where we have the vertical grid lines and also the horizontal grid lines. I'm going to turn off the opacity to 0%. And on this other one, I'm going to put it at 0%. You can see at the background, the grid lines have been turned off. Then I go to symbol and I'm going to check from the week. I'm going to start off from the week. I'm going to give it a black color for the booze and also the beers. we are going to have black color. So I'm also going to check the borders black and also black for the beers. Then for the body, I said I was going to give it a blue color for the booze and also a black color for the beers so i'm just going to select not this black but this black and we're going to be good to go now you can see my chart is looking so perfect like the way i want it to do so now i'm going to go on to customize the macd indicator for those of you who are just watching i'm like how did i get the macd right there so you can just simply come here click indicators and then you search for macd m a c d and then you click on it, then it will appear on the chart. You can see I have two of it because I had already added one before now. So what I want to do is to customize this MACD to look exactly like the MACD on my MetaTrader 5. You can see it has the blue histograms and just one signal line, which is red color. So I'm just going to go over to do that on the trading view platform. Now let's go over and I'm going to show you that. So I'm going to right click on the MACD and go over to the MACD settings just under the style. I'm going to uncheck the histogram and come to the part where we have the MACD and I'm going to click on this line here and change it from a line to histogram right here. And I'm going to maintain the other things to look exactly like that. So you can actually change the color of the MACD if you want to, but I think it's all good with this blue because it looks exactly like the MT5 platform. And that is it. You can see the MACD looks exactly like the MT5 MACD that I use right here. If we go to the MT5 and I just bring this up, you're going to see the, the thing looks exactly alike. And that is how to go over it. Now with this all set, I can just go on to analyzing my chart the way I want it to, and I can just do whatever I want to and have no much attachment to whether it is trading view or it is MetaTrader 5. The next thing I want to do is to show you how to just customize the color of the rectangle that I use in my analysis. I like using an ash color, so I'm just going to select this. You can see it is dark. I can make it lighter by changing the opacity of it by shifting it to this end and I'm good to go. And also next thing I want to do is to use the, the risk to reward for every trade setup. You can see this, I can just put it in here. I can change the color of this particular thing by going to the settings and click on settings right here, right click and come to the settings. And down here, we can check the style for the stop color. You can change it to whatever you want to. I like it like this. So I'm gonna leave it like that. Some people, they use a dark color for the stop and then they use the blue color for um, they use the blue color for the profit. So you can see this is how it looks. If you want to do that that way, then that's all fine. I actually like it the way it was before. And um, guys, this is how far I want to go on this video. I don't want to take so much time. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and also subscribe for more. Don't forget to check the description for link to join my Telegram platform where I share signals every single day. Thank you for watching. My name is Sam Keys and I'm always here to help.